This is a plan with me for the week of October 8th in my classic happy planner. If you'd like to see how this spread came together, then just keep watching. Hi guys, it's Courtney. Welcome back to my channel. We are doing a plan with me in my classic happy planner. This is a look back at last week, which was the first full week of October. Um, and we are planning for October the 8th through the 14th. I am using this kit from Beautiful Planning. And I'm not even really a Halloween person but I love this clip art and just the colors and so yeah I'm doing a lot more with Halloween this year than I thought I was going to um, anyway I have put uh, the washi down across the top so that I can use the date covers because this kit is formatted for Erin Condren planners and um, just in case you didn't know Erin Condren um, the dimensions of that planner are slightly different than the happy planner so you kind of have to tweak it a little bit if you want to use it um, but nothing too major um, and then I also went ahead and put did the washi banner across the weekend um, I divided the boxes because um, I've been watching a lot of happy planner videos and there is I think it's like that happy planner student planners and the teacher planners that have um, the boxes are broken down smaller um, so I was using like the top above the washi was for um, home stuff and then I think the next box I was using for um, stuff for Rowan and then the next box was stuff for me and then the next box was anything else um, and then I dropped the full boxes all the way down or pretty far down on the page um, since I didn't want to use any bottom washi and um, line them up like next to each other so that's what I am doing here So I put the double box in my sidebar because I wasn't, um, I hadn't really planned on tracking much in my sidebar. And then as I was um, going through and putting stuff down, I realized that I, I wanted a little bit more space so I end up pulling that up. And then I'm just going through with uh, my habit trackers. And I must have um, at some point, I don't know, did I like lose some footage here? Anyway, this week turned into a mess, like none of my, I think like trying to do my the boxes that way like threw me off then I didn't 
get like any of my filming stuff done because um, my husband um, ended up fracturing his ankle on Saturday so like he's been home and been trying to like help him around the hat like he couldn't go to work obviously because he couldn't drive so he had Monday off and then Tuesday he worked from home which is fine except for whenever he's home uh, Rowan wants to be where his dad is so I had to try to like keep him quiet and upstairs and I don't it's just been like a struggle this week honestly and I didn't get any of the editing of this done so I just have my usual like half box for occupational therapy then um, like a YouTube tracker that I also use for blog stuff and I had to return some books to the library on Thursday just the usual mom life type things I mean, in the end, I really love how this all came together and I'm in love like with this, the colors in this kit and the clip art that it's, you know, not traditional Halloween colors, but it was a struggle getting here. Um, and then I have uh, that label, they, they were some freebies um, and I just wrote down things that I need to do daily uh, around the house. And those um, like lace doily dividers are from L Plans. I love them. They're so pretty and just, I don't know, it like like haunted mansion and it made it a little bit elegant looking I think I don't know and then I am putting the weekend banner down and then I'm just using a little bit of the deco just go back in and that's it um, everything that I use will be linked down below like I said I really love how this turned out which is why I wanted to get this video up you can see I tried to slice it and it was crooked and it annoyed me but anyway thank you so much for watching I will see you in my next video if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button